This is question 1, paper 2, from this SQA specimen paper for National 5 Mathematics. We've got Beth cycling distance 56 miles, and then during the first week, she increases this distance by 15%, during the second week another 15%, and so on. We're asked to calculate how many miles she'll cycle in the third week. So let's first of all... Uh, talk about increasing quantities by a percentage. So let's take, for instance, the quantity 40. And let's increase it by 25%. That's a quarter. A quarter of 40 is 10. So there's 25% of 40. And we get 50. So we started off with 100% of the 40 and then we added 25% of the 40 to end up with 125% of the 40. So an increase of 25% it's 100% of the original quantity plus another 25%. 125% of the 40. Or doing it in terms of number, numbers, it's one lot of the 40 plus 0 0.25 lots of the 40. That's your quarter. Uh, giving you 1.25 lots of the 40. So this one at the front is the whole quantity. That's the 40 that we started with. And this 0.25 is a 25% increase. Now, this number that we've got here is called the multiplier. And you can see it's made up of the original number 1 giving you the 40 and the 0.25 giving you the percentage increase. So in the case of Beth and her cycling, the multiplier in this case is 1, that gives you the whole 56, 0.15, that gives you the 15% increase. Uh, so the multiplier is 1.15. So the increase in the first week is 15%. So during the first week, she cycles 56 times 1.15. Now we can easily work that out on our calculator. So 56 times 1.15. And that gives us 64.4. During the second week, another increase of 15% takes place. But this time the increase is working on 64.4. So 15% of that. So it's one of the 64.4s and another 0.15 of the 64.4s. So that's the 15% increase of this. So there's our 64.4 on the calculator. We now have to multiply this by 1.15. 74.06 this time. And then the final increase of 15% during the third week, but that's the increase is 15% of 74.06. So you notice that we've now multiplied three times by 1.15. There is a quicker method, and I'll show you that in a little minute. But there's 74.06 multiplied now by 1.15 again, and that equals 85.169. So how many mi miles will she cycle in the third week? She'll cycle 85.169 miles. 
So she cycles approximately 85 miles to the nearest mile. And we're not asked for any particular approximation, but that's a reasonable approximation. We started out with a, a whole number of miles. We should maybe end up with a whole number of miles. You certainly get full marks for just leaving it as 85 uh, point one six nine, but the interesting thing was this multiplication by three lots of one point one five. If you think what went on here, note that uh, fifty six times one point one five times another one point one five that would get us to the seventy four point zero six times another one point one five will give us the answer. And you should be able to write 1.15 multiplied by itself three times as 1.15 cubed. So to do this calculator calculation, let me move calculators. Get rid of that calculator and we'll bring in this different one. Um, 56, let's put that into this calculator times 1.15 raised to the power of, now on this calculator uh, that would be this key, raised to the power 3. We actually got an x cubed button. We could have used that. But there it is, 85.169. So the same calculation a lot faster giving us that final answer.